Welcome to another video from Destinations A to Z. We are in historic Bulls Gap, Tennessee today, home of the world famous Archie Campbell from Hee Haw. That's right, they're having their fall festival. We're gonna take you around and show you what they got. We're going to take you down through here and show you everything they got. We're going to check everything out on the right side first. Then we'll come back around and show you the left side. Here's the event information with the one and only Betsy sitting in here. Bronson sitting back here in the back. One of the things that they do here at the Bulls Gap Fall Festival is that every one of these booths, including the food vendors, actually set up free of charge. Yes, you heard that correctly. They set up free of charge. For more information, you can get a hold of Pete Shipley as well. I'll leave his information down in the link below in the video description below this. It's a great fall day here. The temperature is about Mid 60s right now, climbing up to the low 70s today. You can see here's some Christmas decorations already out. Got a little bit of everything. Face painting. Organic essential oils. There's some great signs to put up around your house, inside your house, some decor. Here's some aloe. Here it looks like Tupperware. Some bowls and jewelry. Here's some pillows with the sporting college collegiate things. I'll get it right in a second. Here's some toys for the kids. They do have live music here as well going on all day. This event is held Saturday and Sunday both. And again, it's free to set up here for this but you do have to get permission from the organizer. Also, since this is free, Bulls Gap does it for the community. They do it for the citizens of the area so they can come here and enjoy this and check out all the crafts, check out all the vendors for free of charge. Again, it's for the community, it's for the people. It's the way that events like this should be held. It should not be held by the cities for the profits. This event is held right after Herdy's Days in historic Rogersville, Tennessee. Be sure if you haven't checked that video out, be sure to check that video out as well. The link is directly above. Here. Here's some tumblers, t shirts. And then it looks like we got some pins and jewelry, a little bit of everything, and keychains. Here it looks like we've got some sweatshirts. With your favorite stuff on it. Here's some more woodworking and signs for welcome. Great looking signs at that.
Here's some more Christmas decorations. It's hard to believe, but it is the end of October. Therefore, we are getting less than two months away from Christmas. Matter of fact, it's almost two months to the day. Here we've got some road signs. A little bit of everything here for the man cave. Then you've got some wreaths. Then you've got uh, some more signs, some baseball caps. T-shirts with your favorite collegiate team. That's boutique clothing. Got shirts and a little bit of everything inside the trailer. Here's some more crafts and tumblers. Here's some crocheted toboggans. And we're into some more woodworking. Some great looking decor items. Here's some reclaimed wood. Sports stuff. More woodworking. Here's some more fall and Christmas decorations. Some wreaths. Welcome home. Some great looking decor items here to spruce up your house. Now we're coming into some vegetables here fresh vegetables for the fall got some apples got some bouquets over there some wreaths some more home decor items and fall items here's some more ornaments Good, yourself? Here we've got some crocheted items. Here's junk from the trunk. A little bit of everything. Here's some jewelry and pins and stuff. Here's some more jewelry. And we got some woodworking stuff here, and looks like some jams and jellies. Here you can see their prices. Here we've got some more jewelry. And we've got some artwork here, along with some Christmas ornaments. And we have some more woodworking bowls. Here, trying to help find the missing kids. It's a great service for the area. Here's some more decor items. Put around your house. Some wood ornaments. Check us out, fresh roasted nuts, cinnamon glazed almonds, pecans, and cashews. Make them right here fresh. Some more decor items and Christmas ornaments. A little bit of jewelry, some signs.
Ah, oh, check out this woodworking stuff here. Talk about nice. We got a person up here looking right in this area right here. She's looking about getting it. This is absolutely gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Here's another one of the tables that he's made. It's actually got his card information. I'm going to zoom in on the card so that way if you need to get a hold of him and get one of these, by all means, check it out. I mean, he makes these by hand. It's absolutely gorgeous work. Check out this little bench. Great looking decor items. Here you can see some of the other work he's got. Some reindeer out of just wood, logs. Here's some more crocheted stuff and jewelry. Here's homemade toys and crafts for the kids. And here we've got Old Stage Candle Company. And we've got pot holders and towels for the kitchen. And up here we've got the food vendors. I'll take you by and show you what they've got here. Looks like there's already a line up here. Got some cotton candy, I see that. Got some nachos, hamburger and chips. We'll go in there and get a good look at the menu. Here you can see the menu and their prices of what they've got to offer. Thank you. 
there you have it. We just took you around and showed you everything that they've got here for Bulls Gap Fall Festival in October. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, don't forget to like it. Don't forget to comment below. Don't forget to share it. And most important of all, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope to see you guys on the next one.